Some takeaways to last minute heroics. This week's Lakefeld Welding and Industrial Supplies Top 5 had it all. Zach Keith had his hands full, picking only five for this week. And Patrick tells us exactly what they were. Columbus Grove starts our top five off this week as Blake Reynolds makes the screen pass to Trevor Taylor and he avoids the whole Ada defense as he navigates his way to the end zone. 50 plus yards. Nice job. Bulldogs getting a solid win last week. Moving on to the number four spot, we have Kenton's Jaron Sharp, who's going to throw it up to Landon Rush, who goes up over the defender, hangs on to the ball. Van Wert thinks they have it, but the ref says otherwise. Remember, kids, don't spike the ball in frustration. Perry breaking out the trick play for our third play of this week as Louis Hurston hands it off to Nylon Cannon, who hands it off to Chaz Jackson, who pitches back to Hurston as he goes back to Cannon downfield, has to put a little move on the defense and gets into the end zone. How about another 50-50 ball here at our runner-up spot as St. John's Jared Worst looks to the end zone, but this time defense wins. Noah Enneking says, not tonight. He takes the ball away from the receiver for the interception. Look at this one again in slow motion. Nice takeaway by the defense. And you might have heard about this week's top play already. Down five with four seconds. Crestview's Drew Klein with ice in his veins. Finishes the game off as he finds Griffin Painter in the end zone for the walk-off and the Knights win what might be game of the year. And that's your Layfeld Industrial and Welding Supplies top five.